Hello. I'm going to demonstrate how to perform an erase flash procedure. The purpose of this procedure is to clear the internal flash, job data, and reset the console to the factory defaults. An erase flash procedure can be performed any time an unexpected guidance or GPS issue occurs. For example, the screen keeps going between warming up and ready frequently. The light bar guides erratically, trying to guide you several passes over to the left or the right, but not the line you are currently on. Or, it will not save the swath width you have entered. Before proceeding with an erase flash procedure, please be sure to document all settings such as swath width and custom NEMA settings as you will be returning the console to its factory default settings. You may re-enter your settings at the end of this procedure. Let's begin. First, disconnect the antenna input from the side of the console. Next, press stop guidance and then enter quickly one after another. This may take several attempts. A menu will appear, BD menu, keyboard test. Now, use the down arrow until the cursor points to the erase flash. When you press enter, the console will display erasing flash and it will count down from 20 and the LEDs will cycle through once. Now turn off the unit, reattach the antenna, and power the unit back on. Now press menu, scroll down to service menu, then press enter. Scroll down to reset defaults and then press enter again. The menu will display Reset Defaults. Press Enter to reset. Press Enter and the console will reset to default. Now press the menu button two times and it will return you to the home screen. You may now re-enter your swath width and any custom settings you may have had. For more videos and 24-7 online support, please visit our knowledge base at outbackguidance.zendesk.com or call 1-800-247-3808 from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Central Standard Time, Monday through Friday, or email us at support at outbackguidance.com. Thank you for your time and have a great rest of your day.